Well met. Hello. It's good to know we've got such a strong Fighters Guild presence here in town. I hear you. Have you heard the odd noises coming from you, Galbalette's place? I thought I heard something the other night. Oh, it's none of my business, though. <laughs> Have you heard any word about the other provinces? I understand. Good. Yes? He's upstairs. I'm Brother Joffrey. What do you want? Emperor Uriel? Do you know something about his death? You'd better explain yourself. Now. You brought me the Amulet of Kings? This cannot be. Let me see it. By the Nine, this is the Amulet of Kings. Who are you? How did you get this? What do you know of the Emperor's death? As unlikely as your story sounds, I believe you. Only the strange destiny of Uriel Septim could have brought you to me carrying the Amulet of Kings. His meaning is unclear to me as well. The Prince of Destruction, Merun's Dagon, is one of the Lords of Oblivion. But the mortal world is protected from the Daedra of Oblivion by magical barriers. I'm not sure. Only the Emperors truly understand the meaning behind the rituals of coronation. The Amulet of Kings is ancient. Saint Alicia herself received it from the gods. When an emperor is crowned, he uses the amulet to light the dragon fires at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. With the emperor dead and no new heir crowned, the dragon fires in the temple will be dark for the first time in centuries. It may be that the dragon fires protected us from a threat that only the emperor was aware of. I am one of the few who know of his existence. One night Uriel called me into his private chambers. A baby boy lay sleeping in a basket. Uriel told me to deliver him somewhere safe. He never told me anything else about the baby, but I knew it was his son. Now it seems that this illegitimate son is the heir to the Septim throne, if he yet lives. His name is Martin. He serves Akatosh in the chapel in the city of Kvach, south of here. You must go to Kvach and find him at once. If the enemy is aware of his existence, as seems likely, he is in terrible danger. And please, let me know if there's anything you need. Waste no time. You must find Martin before the enemy does. Your first priority... I keep a few things here in my chest to... Hello. I'm the shepherd here. 
Eranor's the name. Well, I normally stay out of the affairs of the great folk that come through Waynon Priory to see Master Joffrey. But go ahead and take this hammer. Well, we both have better things to do than stand here all day exchanging idle gossip. If you're looking to buy a horse... I was in Shadenhall last week, and I'm sure I saw Reynold Germain. He acted like he didn't know me, though. Yes, it's quite odd. Reynold, who I've bumped into several times in Coral, acted like I was a complete stranger. Also, he seemed sober, which is a refreshing change. Very odd. You too. How Stop. That's too bad. Okay. We're here to help. Yeah, I've heard of him. I could be wrong, but it seems to me there's something shady going on at the Oak Crozier. Goodbye. Speak, citizen. What do you... The guilds are north, near the Great Oak. Bye. Hey, what do you want? Coral's got plenty to eat. I think Rena Bruyant may actually love dogs more than her husband. Back to work for poor old Orgnall. What's new with you? I've heard that the Nords of Skyrim have been warring with the Rhetoran of Morrowind. The Nords How have always it? been protective of their territory. It's no wonder they get involved in these disputes. You're not afraid of trouble, are you? If you're interested, see Valena Danton in Coral, or Azan in Anvil. Join the guild. You won't regret it. Greetings. Good work. If you're interested, take care. Hello there. Greetings. How may I help you? The Fighters Guild is always looking for new members. If you've got a clean record and don't have a bounty on your head, we may be able to use you. Are you interested in joining? 
Excellent. You are now an associate in the Fighters Guild. You should report to either Azan in Anvil or Burr's Grow Cash in Shade and Elf. You will advance through the... As you complete contracts and fulfill... Be aware, though, that your rank can be stripped... Take care. You will advance as you complete. Be aware. Good day. Evening. They say that the priests and priestesses of the chapel of the Bella all be murdered. No one even knows who did it. No one has any idea who did it. There's some plot that reaches to the streets of Anne. Hello. Take care. I... Greetings, citizen. Well then, it's no small matter. Membership in the guild is quite an honor, but also a responsibility. Very well. You'll need a recommendation from each local guild hall in order to advance further. Welcome to the guild. I'm afraid I can't just write one out. If perhaps you can clear up a small matter involving Irana, you can prove your loyalty to the guild. She and I have an unpleasant history. I have seen that she is in town, though she has not approached me. Determine what she's after and how we may be rid of her. Make haste. I wish to be... Hello there. I found some good pauldrons at the armorer. Ah, yes. You are a guild mage, are you not? There's a small matter with which you may be able to assist. Best if kept just between us, yes? Excellent. It's a simple task, really. All you need to do is fetch a book for me. The book is entitled Fingers of the Mountain. It is of no use to you. You won't be able to read it. You'll find it at an old ruin called Cloud Top. Return it to me immediately when you have it. Greetings. What exactly do you require of me? The news from Anne is Hello there. What do you want? What? Not only does it exist, but she knows where it is? Well, this is unacceptable. I trust that as a member of the guild, you would do the right thing and acquire this text before Irana does. Are we clear? Ignore her request. Go to this place she has described and return with the book. Make haste. I wish to be rid of Irana as soon as Please. possible. What's going on? Thank you. 
Greetings. 